Happy Thanksgiving! It is day 26 of Thanksgiving. Woo! 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 Guys, it is Thanksgiving today. Thanksgiving! Go, 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 go! Guys, I'm so happy and so excited and also so emotional because um, during, you know, eating dinner with my babies, um, you know, I just, I just thank God. Like, you know, you see God, what God has done. And God has done a lot for me today. Like, a lot for me emotionally, mentally. He has done a lot. Because if I listen to my mental health, okay, I would not be on this video right now. I would not, um, how would you say this, be this happy. I wouldn't, I would have not cooked the food. Okay, I would be in some other mental space. But God, but God, okay, um, and my children too. So it was God, my children, and I had to get up. So every day is like a, most of the day, most of the time, I need some type of encouragement to get out of bed. It's, it's just what it is. If I don't got a chore that needs to be done, something I need to do for my kids, there's no reason for me to get out of bed to eat. You just don't understand. But we leave it as that. But I thank God for keeping me, holding me, and prompting me, and giving me the strength and energy to do what I what I have done today. All the glory goes to God. It wasn't me. It was God in me. His spirit is present. Uh, guys, I cooked, and some of the, it was two, wait, actually it was one dish that was not on the menu that I, by accident, stumbled upon it, and purposely I did it, and it tasted mighty fine, and um, I was pretty excited about that. My babies enjoy themselves. They enjoy themselves. And um, they were asking what's going to be on the Christmas menu. <laughs> I, they didn't even, I don't even think they put a spoon in their mouth. Ma, what's going to be on the Christmas menu? And it was, just, it was just so cute. It was just so cute. But when I got on here, before I got on here, there was a song that popped in my head. I would like to share it with you guys because I'm just in that mood. <sighs> With just one look, everything changes. I'm captivated. I never be the same. With just one look, everything changes. I'm captivated. I never be the same with just one look. Okay, I'm gonna stop right there. But that song was in my head. And I just remember when I was eating dinner with the kids, God just touched my heart again. Because again, lately I've been beating myself up. Like, if I said out loud what I was saying to myself, to another person, someone else would intervene. Be like, stop. We don't do that. Don't do that. Approach the person differently. So, um, God has really touched me today and helped me. I'm um, just being real with you guys. <laughs> and um, I just thank God for the strength, mental strength, and the physical strength that I had today, and just give me an uplifting spirit today, because if, again, if I listen to myself, I will be so grumpy, and just not in the mood, but hey, we all humans, we all go through this, so, um, yeah. But I thank God that I was able to cook dinner with my kids, had, um, have a happy dinner with them um it was just 
it was very touching it was very heartfelt today i don't know lately i've been getting so heartfelt and and ooh, i've been reflecting guys and wanting to change certain things about me because there's like an ounce of me that i really don't like sometimes and that ounce can increase to tons to gallons so i wanted to decrease to disappear you know so um yeah i don't know why i mentioned that but i'm really 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 in a good mood right now and um talking to you guys um i did I don't know if I'm going to put it in the beginning or after, but I did record the food that I uh, cooked and the plates. I took a picture of it. I took, oh, I took pictures of me and my kids. We dressed, I dressed up, okay? I dressed up to go to my small kitchen with the oven that I have that doesn't work to eat dinner. Yes. I look like this for dinner. Okay. So I was so happy. My kids was like asking me, are we going to church? Are we going now? Are we going to somebody's house? Is people coming over? I'm like, no, we are eating dinner together amongst ourselves. We usually eat dinner, but we never look fancy, you know? And then on the, there's like a china, a small little china by the fridge and it had glass, um, like glass cups. I was like, my friend, you're doing too much. Next time we just do it. Next time we just, you know, bring out the glass cups, which I am gonna do maybe for Christmas, for Christmas dinner. But my kids asked me if I'm doing some Christmas. My kids asked me what's gonna be on the menu for Christmas. So I already told them it was gonna be some cherry cheesecake pie. Um, I know we make that, but yeah, we didn't do that this year for Thanksgiving. So. Today was really nice, guys. And I pray and I hope that every guy, every, each and every one of you that watches my videos had a awesome Thanksgiving, even if it wasn't the same traditional Thanksgiving you guys usually have, but you was able to be grateful and be happy amongst the family that is with you at the moment. Um, I did not have a traditional meal this year either. I basically cooked but I cook turkey wings, which is phenomenal. I love turkey wings. And I don't think I'm going back to a traditional turkey. Uh-uh. That is too much work for no reason. When you can have the same thing, smaller portion. Let's work. Come on. Um, I, I, I switched it up, okay? I'm Haitian. And you know, the typical Haitian meal, we didn't do all that. Plus, it's only me. You know, I'm not... It, there's females that does does the 10 course meal cooking i'm just not built like that yet you know so we we had some macaroni salad some mac and cheese some rice we had the rice okay the starch we had some potato wedges because my kids look potato wedges i love sweet potato wedges so we had that as well i do not like mashed potatoes don't ask me why but i don't um we had something sweet and savory, which is the candy carrots, not candy yam. We didn't have the, I think it's a beet salad. I, I want to learn how to make the beet salad because I do like beet salad. Well, we had the greens, you know, the veggies. I love veggies and spinach. That that didn't change. Um, and we had cranberry juice. No apple cider, none of that. So I enjoyed it. I, I really enjoyed my meal. Like, I really did. I think it was because I didn't, ha I didn't have to do a lot. Okay, and I had paper plates or plastic, but I don't know what you call them. You could just dump it in the trash. <sighs> bueno. But it was awesome today. Guys, God bless you. Have the, um, hopefully, um, I get to put the video up before midnight. So you can have the rest of an awesome Thanksgiving. If not, happy Black Friday. I hope you guys did not go shopping <laughs> because it's like the same price <laughs> for some things. <laughs> but anyways, I hope they have a deal this year because of the pandemic and stuff. And it really cut down the price because people are not working. So even if the, the TV costs three thousand dollars you went down a thousand let's cut that in half again and another half and make it uh uh, uh let me see 125 is that one no that's 300 so 175 of you 
I don't know how to do math, but anyway, see, I get my point. Oh, two twenty-five will be two fifty, two hundred fifty dollars. That would be five hundred. So, anyways, um, happy Thanksgiving. I love you guys. I am talking so much. I'm so hype. It's all God. Trust me, guys. It's all God. I love you, Jesus. Anyways, have a happy, happy, happy Thanksgiving. This is my church meeting, guys. As I said on yesterday's video that my hubby don't want to jump in the past. So this is my church meeting. Here, the church this is my um, <clears throat> first process of me making sticky rice. I already washed it and um, now it's boiling. Uh, well, it's going to boil, but this is how you make sticky rice. So on the menu, I want sticky rice. I don't want regular rice today. I want sticky rice, so this is what I'm doing. Hi guys, I'm just done with my ripe rice, but this is actually sticky rice, Thai sticky rice. Um, I got the recipe off of um, online, and that's what I had a taste for for Thanksgiving dinner. So the rice is done. This is my turkey wings. Now, I boiled it um, to the point that the meat is falling off the bone. But guys, the flavor is out of this world. The rice that I made, I didn't put no salt. It's just sticky rice, Thai sticky rice. But this is so flavorful when you mix it together. It's like you have a party in your mouth. It's so flavorful. Um, I put a potato in there. There's some onion and tomatoes. Whole tomatoes. I use tomato canned, like the paste or the whole tomato in the can. Everything is fresh in this recipe. So this is my um, turkey stew wings. So guys, I had made um, home potato fries. This is regular potatoes, and this is sweet potatoes. I'm not really a fan of mashed potatoes. Um, if I have to have it, I have to make it, and it have to be homemade from scratch, not the box one. Just boiling the whole potato whole, and um, mashing it, putting the ingredients in it, and eating it like that. I don't like mashed potatoes, so um, for our potatoes today, we're gonna have home fries. This is chickpea. Um, pasta that I'm boiling and then we have um, regular pasta um, that I'm boiling as well the reason why I have chickpea pasta boiling is because I will bring I will be bringing a plate to my friend and she has a gluten allergy so um, that's why I'm boiling the chickpea pasta. I never had chickpea pasta. I remember I bought it a while ago. And um, your girl loves, who is steaming up, I'm sorry. Your girl loves um, pasta. And I'm trying to watch what I eat and everything, like my weight. So um, that's why I have chickpea pasta. But you know, it's Thanksgiving and um, I'm watching out for her. Like, um, Something that's gonna cause your harm, so that's why I'm boiling it. But I'm gonna tell you guys how it tastes, guys. These are the veggie onions that I'm gonna be putting in the pasta salad, and this is the chickpea pasta. The chickpea pasta, the other pasta is cooling down, but I'm going to start on the chickpea macaroni and cheese from scratch. I didn't bake it, I did it on the stove top. Um, um, this is it. Guys, this is my candy carrots. There's no candy yams this year. Oh, but guys, this is amazing. I can't wait to um, share it with my kids and my friend. But this is the candy oh, carrots greens that I have for this year. It's mixed with string beans, spinach. Um, I just mix all the vegetables um, together. It's very flavorful. I can't wait to try it with my rice and stew turkey. Guys, um, this is our Thanksgiving dinner. It's very simple. Um, 
That's the macaroni salad that I made for the first time. This is home fries. We love home fries here. This is the stew turkey. And this is the macaroni salad, the macaroni and cheese I made from scratch on the um, stove top. This is the candy carrots. This is the cornbread that I bought from a supermarket. This is cheesecake drizzled with caramel cinnamon. And this is the sticky rice, Thai sticky rice. And this is the green mix that I made. It's not collard greens, but it's green mix. Spinach, string beans. So it's in kale. I think kale's in there too. 